Right now, we are back in Link's house, which is where you always start after you save and quit the game if you're not inside a dungeon like the Great Deku Tree. While we're in here, I, wa I want to point out a few things. Why the heck does Link need gardening tools like rakes and hoes if he doesn't do any gardening? Hey everybody, it's the McMaster14. Welcome back to more The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. In the last episode, we went inside the Great Deku Tree to break the curse that was placed upon him. But unfortunately, we were not able to save his life. In this episode, we were told by the Great Deku Tree to go to Hyrule Castle, which is exactly what we're going to be doing this time. So let's get playing. This way, we get we read the sign over here. Forest folk shall not leave these woods. This is the way out of the forest. If you tried to come over here before, this guy would be blocking you. Oh, you're leaving. I knew. I knew that you would leave the forest someday, Link. Because you're different from me and my friends. But that's okay. Because we'll be friends forever, won't we? I want you to have this ocarina. Please take good care of it. You received the Fairy Ocarina. This is a memento from Saria. Set it to C and press C to start playing it. On the select item subscreen, you can set it to the, one of the four C buttons, and then, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can play the different notes with A and the four C buttons. You can press B to quit playing, you know, or start a song over again. When you play my Ocarina, I hope you'll think of me and come back to the forest to visit. Now that that cutscene's out of the way, we've now made it to Hyrule Field. And now let's go right ahead. Look who it is! A character that most people don't like. His name is Gabora Gabora. It appears that the time has come for you to start your adventure. You will encounter many hardships ahead. That is your fate. Don't feel discouraged, even during the toughest of times. Go straight this way. You'll see Hyrule Castle. You'll meet a princess there. If you're lost and don't know which way to go, look at the map. There are areas you have explored that are shown on their map. Press start and enter the subscreens to with ZRR to find the map. On the map sub screen, you also see a flashing dot showing where you should go next. Did you get all that? I honestly hate how this defaults to no because if you say no, then he actually explains all that again. Alright then, I'll see you around. Hoot hoot hoot. Yeah, I hate how it defaults to no because it's so annoying to go through all that again. Anyways, we have to go straight ahead to, to make it to Hyrule Castle. However, now I think it's time to talk about one problem I have with this game. Hyrule Field is needlessly expansive. Like, honestly, you have to walk so far. And also, Navi has something to say. The Great Deku Tree wanted us to go, to go to the princess at Hyrule Castle. Yeah, I was doing that! And the sun starts to set right about now. You're just now approaching the gates. And that's a bad thing because you'll soon see why. I want to show this. When it becomes nighttime, the gates to Hyrule Castle close up. And if you were...
If you were just going about the path normally, you would not make it to Hyrule Castle Town, which is the place that we were just in, before you actually... before it becomes nighttime. Which means that you then have to stay out there all night, waiting for, it to, waiting for it to finally become daytime, daytime again, and you can come back in. And I want to break all this stuff because it actually gives us rupees, but there's something else I want to show right here. Break that box and we get another gold sculpture. I want to break as many pots as, as I can because I want all the rupees. Any, any here? Here? Come on, I know there's... Alright. 40 rupees, that's okay. And since we got here at night time, nothing's really happening right now. We will meet this girl right here. Hey, your clothes, they're different. You're not from around here, are you? Da -da 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 -da. Oh, you're a fairy boy from the forest. My name is Malon. My dad owns Lon Lon Ranch. My dad went to the castle to deliver some milk and he hasn't come back yet. Alright. Alright, the shooting gallery. Open only during the day. Yeah, pretty much all these shops right here. There's the, uh, the Happy Mask shop. And there's a bunch of other shops, like a potion shop and the bazaar. All those places are only open during the day. And we kinda got here at night. Also, I really love Malin's singing. But anyways, that's not why we're here. We're now in Hyrule Castle, and I believe... Yep, it's Old Owl Exposition. Hey, Link, this way. The princess is inside the castle, just ahead. Be careful not to get caught by the guards. Hoot, hoot, hoot. On this ground, time flows normally, but time stands still while you're in Lon Lon Ranch or in town. If you want time to pass normally, you will need to leave town. Well, well, which way are you going now? Hoot, hoot, hoot. Do you want to hear what I just said again? No. I hate how it defaults that option. Oh, you're a smart kid. Good luck, then. Alright, time also doesn't flow normally in Kakiri Forest. Just pointing that out. We roll into this tree and we find another gold skeleton. And now, there's actually something I want to do right now. I want to head back into town, and Malin is gone. We go back to Hyrule Castle, and Malin is here now. Doctor again. You're going to the castle, fairy boy. Would you mind finding my dad? He must have fallen asleep somewhere around the castle. What a thing for an adult to do. <laughs> oh, if you look for him, I'll give this to you. I've been incubating this egg very carefully. Tee <laughs> You got a weird egg. It feels like there's something moving inside. Set it to C and see what happens. On the select item subscreen, you can set it to C you can set the yeah 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 yeah. Also, you can't really see it now, but on Malin's chest, she actually has a brooch of Bowser's face, which is interesting. Anyways, what we want to do now is we is we don't want to get caught by the guards, and I believe this. I believe this vine path was actually a bit thicker in the 3DS version. We want to move around here, but we don't want to get caught by the guards. Dead end. Yeah, look, there's guards right up there. They somehow can't see me from like three feet away. Dang it, I got caught. And they just threw me they just threw me right outside the castle without ever making an effort to get back in. 
And also, you couldn't see that text box very well because I got caught. Also, I hate how you can't just, like, climb up anywhere. Why isn't this pass? Oh, whatever. You didn't see the text box, but it did say that our egg hatched. It's the miracle of birth. And we now have a chicken. Now this time, let's not get caught. Yeah, these guards are bad at their jobs. I mean, I'm just waltzing through Hyrule Castle and they're not stopping me. Maybe the king should have hired some guards with better eyesight because they cannot apparently see anything. And now we want to want to jump in the moat and flow down here. Also, you get some rupees, which is nice. So we're getting some money. But I believe you can get five rupees from there. So interesting. And also up here, this is Malin's dad. And also you can see you can see the brooch of Bowser's face a little bit better there. See? Kinda hard to get a good angle of it, but it's there. Now let's wake him up. One tarnation! Can a person get a little shut eye around here? Where are you? Hello, who might you be? Yep, I'm Talon, owner of Lon Lon Ranch. I went to the castle to deliver milk, but I sat down here to get some rest, and I guess I fell asleep. What? Mom was looking for me. I'm gonna catch it from her now. I must feel bad. Leaving Talon behind to wait for me? She's really gonna let me have it. Still got a little bit of a cough, so I might need to clear my throat a couple times. Now I have a bit of a puzzle here. You have to push these boxes of milk, which I'm guessing is what Talon delivered. Man, he must be really strong to push these boxes of milk, I'm guessing. Definitely seems like milk since it has the cow face on it. Also, it's starting to get dark again. The days in Hyrule ca the days in Hyrule really move by fast. There's that jingle again, which means we've solved it. So now we have to jump right around, right up here, and climb through this little tunnel, remaining surprisingly dry. Oh. Why were you there? Do I have to wait till it's daytime? I think we have to wait till it's daytime. That is weird. That has never happened to me before. Yep, they stop you every time unless it's daytime. <laughs> Alright, so it looks like we're gonna have to wait for like another minute for it to become daytime. Which is annoying, and I don't understand why we can't just go. Why we can't just like sneak past them right now. But that's that's just the way it works. Also, apparently there was a rupee in that tree. But now you can. You can really see how quickly the days go by. That moon was going by fast. Also, you cannot open this door. It's just there for decoration. You do. Right, I think once the rooster sounds, we should be good to go. There it is. I think we're good. I think we're good now.
Hey, right, those annoying guards aren't there anymore. But we still got a bit of a stealth section here. We have to wait for this guard to go by, which apparently he can't see me through the hedge. Snake by him. And we've got more guards. And again, apparently they can't see me over the fountains, but whatever. And since we can most likely assume that this guard can't see can't see above him. Oh shoot, that was risky. Ha, ah, I still got the money though. That was that was interesting. Alright, this one I can actually understand that the guard can't see us over the wall, but I still don't know how Link can tell where the guards are supposed to be. I mean, obviously we can tell where they are, but how is he supposed to know? Alright, I think now it's good to sneak by. And that castle is... Castle? That statue is just a 2D sprite. You can very easily tell it. So, good sculpting job, whoever made that. You just stuck a painting onto a, onto a pedestal. Oh, don't want to get seen. Right, that guard apparently just disappeared. So did the other one. Oh, no, they're right there. Also, another statue that's just a 2D sprite. Man, the king must have not paid his sculptors very much. Alright, we've made it past all the guards. And we've now made the castle courtyard, and the princess is right up there. Before we go to her, however... Most of you probably know this already, but if you look into this castle window, you can see paintings of Yoshi, M Princess Peach, Mario, Bowser, and if you look all the way to the left, you can also see Luigi. That's a pretty nice easter egg, and in the 3DS version, it was actually replaced by a Super Mario level, so I like that reference. I like it. Let's go talk to her. Who? Who are you? How'd you get past the guards? Because they can't see. I mean, honestly, they're like the stormtroopers of seeing. Wait, what's that? Is that... A fairy? Then, are you... Are you from the forest? Then... Then you wouldn't happen to have a spiritual stone of the forest, would, would you? That green shining stone. You have it? Mm, yep, I do. <laughs> Just as I thought. I had a dream. In the dream, a dark storm dark storm clouds were billowing over the land of Hyrule. But suddenly a ray of light shot out of the forest and parted the clouds and lit up the ground. The light turned into a figure with a green shining stone followed by a fairy. I knew this is a prophecy that if someone came from the forest, yes, I thought you might be the one. Oh, I'm sorry. I got carried away with my story. I didn't even properly introduce myself. I'm Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. What is your name? Link. Strange, it sounds somehow familiar. Okay then, Link. I'm going to tell you the secret of the sacred realm that has been passed down by the royal family of Hyrule. Please keep the secret from everyone. Okay. The legend goes like this. The three goddesses hit the Triforce containing the power of the gods somewhere in Hyrule. 
the power to grant the wish of the one who holds the Triforce in his hands. If someone with a righteous heart makes a wish, they'll lead Hyrule to a golden age of prophecy. Prosperity. If someone with an evil mind has, has his wish granted, the world will be consumed by evil that was, has been told. So the ancient sages built the Temple of Time to protect the Triforce from the evil ones. That's right, the Temple of Time is the entrance through which you can enter the sacred realm from our world. But the entrance is sealed in a stone wall called the Door of Time. In order to open the door, it is said that you need to collect three spiritual stones. Another thing is, the treasure of the royal family keeps along with this legend. The Ocarina of Time. Did you understand well, the story I just told you? At least that one defaults to yes. That's great. I forgot to tell you. I was spying through this window just now. The other element from my dream, the dark clouds, I believe they symbolize that man there. Will you look through the window at him? Yeah. I love spying. That wasn't meant to be creepy. Can you see the man with the evil eyes? That's Gandorf, the leader of the Gerudos. They hail from the desert to the far west. Ah, the Deku tree warned, up, warned us of a man from the desert. Though he swears allegiance to my father, I'm sure he's not sincere. The dark clouds that covered Hyrule in my dream, they must symbolize that man. What happened? Did he see you? Don't worry. He doesn't have any idea what we're planning. Yet. Yes. I told my father about my dream. However, he didn't believe it was a prophecy. But I could sense the man's evil intentions. What Gandorf is after must be nothing less than the Triforce of the Sacred Realm. He must have come to Hyrule to obtain it. And he wants to conquer Hyrule. No. The entire world. Link, now we're the only ones who can protect Hyrule. Please. Okay. Thank you. I, I'm afraid. I have a feeling that this man is going to destroy Hyrule. He has such terrifying power. But it's fortunate that you've come. We must not let Gandorf get the Triforce. I'll protect the Ocarina of Time with all my power. He shall not have it. You go find the other two spiritual stones. Let's get the Triforce before Gandorf does, and then defeat him. One more thing. Take this letter. I'm sure it'll be helpful to you. You received Zelda's letter! Wow! This letter is Princess Zelda's autograph. Said to see and show with C. Yay, yeah, yeah, we've seen that before. Jeez, that text box is annoying. Alright, now let's head outside and... Oh. I didn't sneak in at all. Just telling you, I didn't sneak in. They let me in. I am Impa of the Sheikahs. I am responsible for protecting Princess Zelda. Everything is exactly as the princess foretold. Then why don't you go tell the king? You're a courageous boy. You're heading on a big new adventure, aren't you? My role in the princess's dream was to teach a melody of the one from the forest. There's an ancient melody passed down by the royal family. I've played this song for Princess Zelda as a lullaby ever since she was a baby. There's a mysterious power in these notes. Now listen carefully. Left, up, right, left, up, right. So it's just the same three notes repeated. Okay. Also, it's incredible that you managed to make those notes with your hand. Alright, we played it. It's our first time playing the ocarina, actually.
You've learned Zelda's lullaby. If the castle soldiers find you, there will be trouble. Let me lead you out of the castle. Didn't say out of town. You brave lad, we must protect the beautiful land of Hyrule. Take a good look at that mound. That is Death Mountain, home of the Gorons. They hold the spiritual stone of fire. At the foot of Death Mountain, you'll find my village, Kakariko. That is where I was born and raised. You should talk to some of the villagers there before you go up to Death Mountain. The song I just taught you has some mysterious power. Only members of the royal family are allowed to learn this song. Remember, it will help prove your connection with the royal family. The princess is waiting for you to return to the castle with the stones. Alright, we're counting on you. Why can't you help me get the stones? Now, ah, whatever. Alright, now let's go back into town to end the video off. I was planning on doing... I was planning on doing something else in Hyrule Castle Town in this video, but it's already well over 25 minutes long. That I think I'm just going to hold it off till next episode. But I do like the music in Hyrule Castle Town during daytime. Anyways, that's all the time we have for this video. Next time on The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, we're going to be completing a few side missions that we can do in Hyrule Castle and in, in, and in Kakiri Forest. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you can, like, comment, and subscribe because that would really help out the channel. And with that, I'll see you guys next time. Mechmaster, out.